Good morning, friends, family, loved ones, hopefully some new friends. If you're new, welcome to my channel. If you've been here before, welcome back. As always, it's great to see everyone. I'm so happy you could join me this morning. Uh, it is super important to stay in touch and connected during this time of relative isolation. <clears throat> oh, allergies, 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 right? So I thought it would be fun to talk about a couple of things today. Um, one being this crazy source of humor around my house all weekend, and that's toilet paper. We'll, we'll get to that in a minute. But I do also want to remind everybody so just exercise some common sense, stay safe, stay, um, stay healthy, stay connected. Um, it turns out this coronavirus is a little more serious than I originally thought it was. I'm kind of grateful for the stay at home, <clears throat> um, the stay at home order. And about that, I can't believe Today, Monday, April 20th, is starting my sixth week of working at home. Five weeks have gone by since we got the order to work at home. I can't believe it's been that much time already. It's kind of all flowing together, and I'm sure there's a lot of other people out there experiencing the same thing. Um, as I mentioned in my last video, my last one, one of my recent videos, um, that it is important to um, take action to differentiate the uh, weekdays from the weekends or, you know, just the days from each other. Eventually, we'll all have to go back to work and resume a an, a normal schedule. So I'm really trying not to get too far away from my normal um, routine, except I get to do things like take that extra walk in the morning, which has been really good for me as, you know, the only exercise most of us are getting is walking around the house or um, some of us have stairs so we can go up and down the stairs. But it's not really the same, right? I can practice yoga. Okay, that's that's helpful. I'm sure there's a lot of people doing that at home as well. <clears throat> but I'm finding that morning walk also helps to get the blood circulating, helps me kind of get focused, and then I come back and finish getting ready for my day. So I did that this morning beautiful spring day here in Arizona. Loving, loving this weather. It's supposed to be 86 degrees today. And we're going to have to turn the air pretty soon. Not looking forward to that. But grateful that we have air conditioning, right? So the toilet paper. This is just the, I, I, can't even, I don't even know where to begin talking about my, the way I feel about this. It's just, I, I don't know. So we'll go ahead and start. So this is a, uh, I think they call it an extended roll uh, of Kroger brand. And it's relatively thin. You can see it's, you know, one ply not really anything <clears throat> anything special just normal cheap toilet paper right okay so on the 15th of march just a couple of days after we got the um, stay at home orders from work and i don't remember the exact date our governor you know, made it a statewide thing. 
but anyway, it was on the 15th of March when this whole thing started with people staying home. I ordered just to be on the safe side because I heard that there was a big rush to the grocery stores and long lines and I mean, we were fine. We were pretty stocked up, but just in case, I didn't get back to the store before we started running low or, you know, God forbid the stores sold out and we couldn't get it by the time we needed. Thought I'd hedge my bets just a little bit and order some online. So, bathroom tissue from Amazon. Let me read you the um, the description. And I don't I don't know how to say pronounce this word, but it looks like um, jokin. Household roll paper, white three layer toilet roll tissue, empty core soft paper towels, ten rolls. For a penny. Now, I knew that it was not going to be great. I thought it was going to be a lot like this, only smaller. This is an extended roll. I thought it'd be like normal roll. So it showed up on Saturday. Let me show you what I got. Ten of these tiny rolls compared to my regular roll. Hysterical, right? So <laughs> I paid $15 for shipping. Yes, one penny, $15 for shipping. You know that you're just getting ripped off and you're not really paying $15 for shipping. That's what they're, you know. So this is actually a much softer, much nicer roll than my Kroger brand, but it's tiny. It's tiny, like tiny. <laughs> so we had a lot of fun with my, um, with, with me getting ripped off buying bathroom tissue. Fortunately, it, it wasn't that big a deal. I had the $15. It's embarrassing. It's embarrassing. Okay. I didn't expect much. But now I've got, I don't know. I'll use it to blow my nose or something. It's, I don't know. Anyway, had to share the toilet paper story because that just cracks me up. So the next thing I'd love to talk about is just check in. How's everybody doing? I got taken on some toilet paper, right? But on a more serious note, does everybody have what they need? There's a lot of people that don't. Um, I'm fortunate. We were pretty well stocked before this started. We've been going to the store once or twice a week um, during low traffic times. <clears throat> or if I go by myself early in the morning just to run in and grab essentials that I may not have been able to get before. We've talked about this. But um, I'm fortunate. And I know a lot of people are struggling. And I really want to send out my thoughts and prayers and, and warm thoughts to people who are not as fortunate. They can't get what they need. They've lost their jobs and can't afford what they need. Um, all of that, it's, it's so heartbreaking. But it's also important to keep our minds, our mental health, keep our minds sharp and and tuned up <clears throat> there was a story up in Canada over the weekend 
some guy, I don't know if it was boredom, if he just got a little stir crazy being locked up at home. I, I don't know the whole story, but he went out and shot up a bunch of people and lit houses on fire. I haven't read the whole story. I just kind of caught a bit of a headline. So I will go read that later. But, you know, let, let's not get to that point. You know, let's take care of our minds as much as our bodies. Keep ourselves healthy and and in touch with reality. So that said, um, I know this is a short video. I just wanted to touch in, have our have a little check in, and send my um, love and warm thoughts out to everyone. <coughs> <laughs> Yes, I'll go wash my hands and, and sanitize everything on my desk, even though I'm here alone. Um, well, my partner, but he doesn't bother my office. But anyway, I do um, do want to send all the best out to everyone who's feeling isolated and alone. You're not. You're not. Um, Leave me comments. I don't get a lot of them, so I'm likely to respond. If you leave a comment, I am likely to respond and, and reach out and try to be encouraging. And I really hope that for everyone. Um, continue to be encouraging to one another. We are all in this together, alone, together. So staying home alone together. Maybe that's a, we'll see. But um, I do have to get ready to actually work today. So on that note, as always, stay safe, stay healthy, stay in touch, stay blessed. I love you all. We'll talk to you again soon.